The queen works away on her own. As soon as possible, an egg will be deposited in each cell of the nest. But an approaching thunderstorm is stopping the construction work. As soon as the shower is over, the queen has to dry the nest. At first, she sucks up the water. Her abdomen is holding it. Then she turns her head down over the edge and regurgitates the water. Once the cells are dry, she starts drying the walls. The eggs inside the cells have to be kept dried. Hive or house bumblebees take care of the brood and build new cells. Others gather food. Nectar and pollen are stored in designated cells, from which the bumblebees serve themselves. Only the larvae will be mouth-fed. For that, a worker bumblebee bites open a breeding cell, feeds the larva, and closes the cell again. The young bumblebee is still damp and tousled, and without distinctive colors. Only when her black and yellow stripes have developed in a few days' time will the young bumblebee fly for the first time. At first, she circles above the entrance. This is so she can remember where the hive is. Gradually, the circles become bigger. She explores the area and finds her first flower. At the edge of a field are some red corn poppies. The nutritious pollen is collected and carried back to the underground hive. 